how come you joined the finance industry uh, in the first place? What attracted you to it and what sort of skills or values did you bring to the industry? Yeah, I sort of came into the finance industry a little bit by mistake or, or good luck. Um, I enjoyed economics at school. I did reasonably well in economics, but really I joined a very good firm um, back uh, when, I really, when I finished school and studied uh, economics at university at night. I joined the NRMA and, and they gave me lots of opportunities to try different things. And then I found something I enjoyed, which was the investing side of the business. Something I enjoyed um, and, and hopefully over time I developed some skills around. But it was really through joining a, a great company, a, a company with very good ethics and that gave opportunity to, to young people. Well, I actually got into finance a little indirectly. Um, I was a lawyer. I worked for a large national law firm and by accident, actually, I ended up doing a lot of work for banks and then for fund managers and asset managers. And uh, that, for various reasons, attracted me. And then AMP knocked on my door, asked if I'd like to go over to AMP, which I did, and found that I enjoyed the industry even more than I had from the outside. And uh, then that led to the role here at Commonwealth Bank. Once I became more familiar with the products, the services, the ideas, the advice we give, I fell in love with it as an industry because it does such great things for so many people. So it became a natural fit for me and, I, and I've been here ever since and enjoyed it thoroughly. Joining one of the best brands in the industry and one and a firm that I've always admired was, I think, a critical decision and one that I've never regretted over the last 13 years. I've been involved in the uh, industry for about 15 years. My first job was at IAG in a corporate affairs role. Uh, thereafter, I spent 10 years as the head of the Bankers Association. So as you can imagine, I got very actively involved in a lot of interesting banking related issues. When I thought I was retiring from investment banking because I'd taken on the chancellorship of Bond University, chairman of UGL, I was on the board of the ASX, chairman of QIC and just went on the Future Fund, uh, I decided I would focus on those interests. And then the Rothschild family approached me to become involved in Rothschilds. And I, I'm delighted I did.